real hardcore resistance to him. I think the majority of voters in our party are resistant to him. And as the race narrows, it's going to become more apparent. Um, but, but right now, I'm focused on the next day up. You know, we're in Michigan here today. We're campaigning hard. And we're really looking forward to Florida March 15th. That's going to be a big night for us. We're focused on that right now. We're, we feel really good about the states that are coming up. And you know how this process is. Talking to me again on Saturday and on Monday, and after more votes come in, the dynamic changes again. There's been so many ups and downs in this race. And conventional wisdom has been wrong the entire time. All right, Dad, uh, amen. Let me ask you then a substance question of, of, of very great importance. A lot of people say, boy, Marco Rubio is young. John F. Kennedy was young. He was pushed around by Khrushchev in Vienna in June 1961. Would Putin and others push around a Marco Rubio the way that Kennedy led to the Cuban Missile Crisis because he was perceived as young and weak by a... You know, go ahead. One, one of the people that's dealt with Putin the most by being in the opposition is Gary Kasparov, who's a great chess master, who's a vocal and the eminent op opponent of Putin. He's talked repeatedly about how in this race, I am the best person to stand up to Vladimir Putin because I understand who he is, because I understand the geopolitics of the region. Uh, He's made that assessment, and I think it's something to listen to. Look, Donald Trump has no foreign policy ideas. On the contrary, he has a very dangerous approach to foreign policy. It's very disruptive. I think Ted Cruz has already, you know, in many ways has adopted kind of the lead from behind uh, foreign policy of Barack Obama on certain parts of the world. Again, it's not a slam on Ted, by the way, who I like and, and, and get along. It's, it's, he doesn't have the dangerous ideas that Donald Trump has. But I just feel like the guy like Gary Kasparov, someone who understands and knows Vladimir Putin, has seen him work firsthand. He believes I'm not the best position to stand up to Putin. In the entire race, that includes Hillary. Let me talk about Hillary then and her service.